with a population of over 3 million people. This is Japan's second largest city. You've got history, culture, amazing views, and a laid back vibe. Welcome to Yokohama. as with every stop on this Japan tour I've got a challenge to complete so let's see what my Yokohama challenge has in store for us Japan is one of the fastest spoken languages in the world spend the day learning to say Japanese tongue twisters as fast as possible but before twisting my tongue out let's explore everything Yokohama has to offer my first stop in Yokohama is the Shin Yokohama ramen museum I thought it was really cool cool to learn a lot of interesting facts about ramen that I didn't know before. And when you come here, make sure to go down to the basement floor where they've got a bunch of delicious ramen shops located inside this old school Japanese metropolis movie set. You're gonna have to wait a little while to get your food, but it's worth it. It's so fresh. In a country like Japan, where foreign influence was heavily restricted throughout history, the country was closed to the world for over 200 years. Yokohama stands out as the first port city that was marked as the entrance to Japan. As a result, Yokohama is a melting pot of cultures and innovation. It's the home of Japan's first newspaper, as well as Japan's first gas-powered street lamp. Even today, just a walk around downtown Yokohama and you can tell how modern this city is. And yet, even though it's a 22-minute train ride from Tokyo, it has a much slower and laid-back atmosphere than Japan's capital. Taking in the beautiful sunset here in Yokohama's Rinko Park. It's just on the bay here and this just summarizes what I love about Yokohama. It reminds me a little bit of my home hometown of St. Petersburg, Florida. Beautiful scenery, doesn't overwhelm you. It's a city that you feel like you can call home. I can look, I see like two people over there, one person over there, one person over there. Otherwise, it's all mine. Hold up, I'm getting a little ahead of myself here. I've still got a challenge to complete. Hayoguchi ga toba o shiteimasu ka? してます。私とレイを共有できますか。できます。赤羽じゃ巻き、パジャマ、青パジャマ。赤羽じゃ巻き、パジャマ。青パジャマ。青パジャマ。青パジャマ。青パジャマ。青パジャマ。青パジャマ
culture that's not my own native culture. It's Chinatown, but I don't know, there's something to me at least that has a distinct Japanese feel as well. Just the way the signs pop out and stack on the streets. Then it's got the foods, the flavors, the lanterns, everything else is Chinese. It is a really cool scene here. That's gonna do it from Yokohama, everyone. Maybe one day, with some practice, I'll get those tongue twisters down. Who am I kidding? Probably not. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a like, and I'll see y'all for the next episode. On the next episode of my On the Ground Japan tour. Ride a chicken? Do you know where I can find a very large chicken?